What's up guys, so in this video I want to show how to wire up three-way light switches. Let's go. Alright guys, so this is my one for demonstrations. And first things first, let's not forget to wear our, our safety glasses. So to begin, we are wanting to wire up a three-way light switch system. Now, what we're basically doing is turning on one light from two different locations. So this might seem a little tricky, a little compl complex, but to do this, if you can just remember two simple things, you'll never forget how to do it. Number one, on one side, meaning on one switch, you have to have your hot, your live power. And on the other side, your other switch, you have to have your switch leg up to the light itself. And then in between your travelers, which is 12.3. So let's go ahead and see this in live action. So first things first, we have our live power right here. Let's go ahead and staple that up to the wall, put it in code. Okay. Now next, from here, remember we have our power in the first box. Now in between, from box to box, we want to use our 12.3. Let's go ahead and do that. So there we have it. From box to box, our travelers. Now let's go from our second box, which is the second point, which was the switch leg. Let's go up from the second box to our light with 12.2. Let's go ahead and see that happen. So there we have it. So to recap here, we have our incoming hot on one side. And then in between, from box to box, we have our 12.3 travelers. And then from our second box up to our light itself, we have 12.2, which is, consists of our switch leg. So that's basically the ideal concept on how to wire up a three-way light switch system. Now, let's see this when it's actually the finished product. All right, so go ahead and first off, strip the sheathing to the 12.3, as well as the sheathing to your power. Now what I like to do is I like to separate my neutral, my travelers and my hot, and I like to start with the grounds. Now because this is a stranded and this is solid ground, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make what is called a pigtail. I like to push my ground as far as I can in that corner, push both of them, cut it like, put it like right. Like right here. Strip your ground. Like so. Strip those together. Cut a little bit off. your ground on there. Now just roll that back up. Set the ground back there in the corner for now. Next I like to move down to my neutrals. Now the switches don't necessarily need the neutral so what I like to do here is push your neutral into the corner. Push both of them into the corner. Make sure you have six inches out. I like to kind of Put it right there. Even those out. You're supposed to give yourself about a good half inch to three quarter of strip. The same thing like the grounds, put a cap on them. Put a little B cap on it. Twist those nice and tight. Again, like I said, push them in the corner. Fold it up real nice and pretty in there. That way 
you don't have any issue when putting your switch. So next we are left with our power. Like we said, remember, step one was establish your power and then have in between your travelers. So if you were going to be in what's called the roughing stage, when the house is barely new, you're barely wiring it, you would normally twist these up like this and then cut them six inches out and then roll them back in as well as your hot. But in this case, so I can go ahead and so we can see the finishing product ahead of time, we're gonna go ahead and push these back in there in one corner, cut our six inches. And there we have it, we have our hot and we have our two travelers. Now keep these two in mind whenever we go to mounting our switch, we'll see that uh, for ourselves. Now on this other side here, it's basically the same way. Strip your sheeting off, make up your grounds, your neutrals, as well as your travelers and your switch leg going up to the light. Let's go ahead and do this real quick. Okay, so like the other switch had our power. On this side here, we have our travelers going from box to box and our switch leg going from our second box to our light itself. So let's go ahead and put some switches on this and let's go ahead and see how the light turns on. So now to wire up the switch itself, you see this is a three-way switch here. It's got three screws, a black screw and you have two golds. The black is going to be for your live power and these two gold screws will be for your travelers. Let's go ahead and see those on. So your black will take your hot live wire or your switch leg. And these two golds here will go for your travelers, red or black, it doesn't matter which one you put. All right, so let's go ahead and see the finishing product. So remember, with box number one, we had on one side our hot and on the other side, the second switch was our switch leg. And in between, we went with 12.3, which was our travelers. So let's go ahead and see the slide turn on. There it is from there. Now from the other location, and it'll also turn off and off. There you have it. That is how you wire up a three-way light switch system. Now, in the future, I'm also going to be making a video on how to wire up a four-way light switch system, which is turning on a light from three different locations. Stay tuned. And if you like what you saw here, please like and subscribe, share it with your friends. It would definitely be appreciated. Thank you.